Ladies and gentlemen, Michael said in tomb. I like Pestermite. He likes in tomb. Oh, I didn't see the Pestermite actually. You like Pestermite? You want to do that? Yeah, because the Reanimator deck is like harder to get. I think. I think it is. I agree with you. And Pestermite can be just fine in any blue deck, even if you don't I took the it. Combo. Time walk right here. You ready? Someone's like, I took a Lotus, so I passed the time walk, and that's that's okay with me. You okay. Yeah. Uh, What's the matter with you? Why are you acting like this? You want to still switch off when we're playing it? Yeah, if we can use controller, that'd be fine. Okay. It's a little more awkward to keep. Because I've already else. played it, so. Was that so? You'll just know where to go all the time. No, it's been a while, man. That game's been out a while. It's been a while I'm not since to go. I've had some time. I've been like I remember the story and a couple battles, but I don't remember like where to go and stuff. Bioshock Infinite with controllers should be fine because it was released for consoles, right? Yeah, of course. I know you wouldn't play with a controller. Should I play with a controller? I mean, it's an FES, so you could play with a mouse and keyboard. Just fine. Right, I can. But I'm talking about, like, it's easier to switch off. Yes. Yeah, I don't know if we're a Pestermite deck. That's true. That's a good point. I hadn't considered that yet, actually. Are we a Yogmoth's Bargain deck? I would either take Venser or Sword. I like Venser a lot. I think Venser is better than Sword, but I think that, that's my Bargain favorite. is not the card to go on on Storm for. Plus, I'll probably table if we wanted to do that. Man, Bioshock Infinite came out in 2013. Okay, six yeah, it's years been a while, man. <laughs> man, I've been taking my time. <laughs> I was yeah. like, I'll get around to it. Dude, I really seriously want to play Witcher 3, but it's like 70 hours. I mean, you could play it, just not on stream. That'd be a long stream. Well, how long is the main story? 51 hours. That's pretty long. Main and extra is 103 hours. That's like it's twice as long. So it'd be, well, it'd be 25 sessions, right? Yeah. Three times a week? That would take us forever. Yeah. So it'd probably be closer to 60, right? Because, like, even if you don't do all of the extras, you're going to do some. So this right. is there's no way you're just going to go, like, straight through only to the main story. So I'd, I would say it's probably closer to, like, 66 hours, maybe. So, like, divide that by three. What do you get? 22? It would take 22 weeks. <laughs> That's half a year, dude. <laughs> yeah. Uh, that's why I like Not short that. games. I like eight hour, eight to twenty hour games because you can usually get those done in like three weeks, two weeks. This is a pretty late Stoneforge. I also like this Baral. Eh. Oh, Baral's only really good in Storm. I do like Stoneforge. Let's take Stoneforge. Stony Baloney. Stony Habalone. I don't think that's actually a late Stoneforge. I just don't think Stoneforge is actually that appreciated in this cube. No, you have to have a. It doesn't. It's like you need another card with it. Which one? A sortie, a boardy, a boardy, a little squarty. I think you have brain damage. <laughs> Might. That is a late wow. liver of Alexandria. Snapping that up. Four, three other people were like, "Nah, I'm also good. really late volcanic." Jeez. Yeah, I'm taking this. Yeah, library's nuts. Take it over my fucking dead body. Force. I do like force. I also like hollowed fountain. I think I like hollowed yeah. fountain more. Well, we're not necessarily white yet. We just have one stone forge. Oh, you want another stone forge? Well, I mean, like, we don't have to be white. Plus, we were just blue-white. I don't know why people try to play Skyscanner on their non-artifact decks. Holy shit, that's a solid meme. Which one is it, man? Force of Will's good if we do end up Splinter Twinning. Yeah, I'm gonna take Force of Will. I like Underground City. Yeah, then we can just wheel the Nico Bolas. I don't hate that. Well, I think it's... There's nothing really that It's greedy with library. Oh, or is that... Uh, fine, nah. Eh. I think it's still Underground Sea. Underground Sea. Underground Sea. Yeah, that's a pretty good angel sanction, though. This card's good. I think this card's great. You want to talk about your TTs? <laughs> what? Your TTs. The thing in the ice? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, oh, boy! Oh, hey, that's pretty good. All right, so we're, we're looking at Esper. Which is sad, because that means this guy's a dummy, but... This guy's a dummy. <laughs> sure you react to his version of it. What does that mean? What are you saying right now? Look at these two Michael Scott memes on my thing. They, they're they just two pictures of Michael Scott. <laughs> and I can tell which one which it one is. Which one is which? 
Uh, this is the uh, nope, don't like that, and this one's the I'm dead inside. Ah. Uh. No, don't like that. Uh, I'm take... dead inside. Shriek Look, the Entomb here. came back. Yeah, yeah Shriek Maw's fine. Entomb's only really I like good. Arena. It's all black, though. Oh, shit, you're right. I didn't think about that. Wow, it is double black. That's crazy, dude. Plus, we're leaning towards blue-white currently. How? Colonnade, Angel, Stoneforge. Whatever, man. Earlier, I said I hate when people play Pestamite and non-Pestamite. Did you really say that? I just didn't see it, man. I'm sorry. I just missed it, man. Why don't you worry, 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 worry all the time? He also said it first, okay? Worry, 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 worry. Oh, oh shit, I closed my... Why did I close the lid on this thing? So you don't spill? That's a late troops. Also a ba uh, resto angel. Oh, I like resto here. We got Venser, Shriek Maw, Pestermite, Stoneforge. Oh yeah, that's that's gas. I don't think any swords are coming back, which is unfortunate. I don't care about all that. All I want is Jitay and Batterskull, bitch. <laughs> it's Brittany, bitch. <laughs> Your name Brittany now? My name has always been Brittany. I just huh. tricked you. Oh. You dumb MFR. Got him. New to Legacy, so we'll try to follow a card. This is Vintage Cube, my dude. This sort of could be good sometimes. It's all right. It's like the what's like one of the worst. Oh, you're just messing with me. Oh, now it's all fun and games. Oh, when Gamma Set, when Gamma Set wants to joke around, it's all funny. Oh, Seth, what's going on, my dude? Thank you for the raid, man. Seth Manfield, my boy. Yeah, we could end Tomb and Shallow Grave. What do you want? What? Why? Nothing's ever good enough for you. Seth, what's going on, dude? I hope you're doing super well, man. I think it's manatized. I just want to get him. Seth, what were you playing? Also, congrats on your top eight, dude. <laughs> oh, God. It's like, I feel like Seth doesn't even enter events without top eighting them. It's just not worth his time if he doesn't top eight them. So he, he only goes he only goes when he knows that he's going to top eight, which is all of them. Is it Ancient, Ancient Tomb? Tomb? yeah. I like Ancient Tomb. Are we too color intensive for Ancient Tomb? Nah. Oh, my God. The Pioneer Lotus Field deck. Of course you were. Of course you were. We're not necessarily black yet. I think it's funny that MTG just announced Pioneer like so recently because it I feel like it takes away from Arena. I would say Thirst, but like... Yeah. Seth, have a good night, buddy. Thanks so much for the, for the raid, man. I really appreciate you. I'm glad to hear you're doing great, dude. Ancient Tomb. Oh, that's probably just Vindicate, right? Vindicate's definitely... We're not going to take Oath of a Price over Vindicate, right? I still think Ancient Tomb is way stronger. I don't think we're... I think this is this deck's going to have too many... It also doesn't commit us to black yet. <sighs> Why are you like this? I don't care. Oh, God. It does. It does. We have Underground. I want Vindicate. I'm sorry. Okay. I want the Vindicate. We can get him again. You want to play another match with Days and? Uh, we could also take an opposition here. It's pretty early. What are we gonna? What are we gonna tap? What are we gonna tap? Come on, man. I mean, it's a build around. Frank, for my last almost thirty-five, can I add a step specifically? You see, Oath of Druids in the first. I don't think Oath is in this cube. Is Oath in the cube, Josh? Can you double check? Because I would definitely do that if if it, if you can find it if it's in the cube. I haven't seen it yet though. Either against me or in my packs. Oh, it is? Yeah, we can do that. I mean, your last donation is only for like 32 dude. So you're going to have to add the extra $3, obviously. <laughs> just just totally kidding. I was like, I don't even want this to be misconstrued as being serious. Um, God. I don't think it's opposition. It's really strong, but I don't think it is. It could just be Soulfire again. Soulfire will. We could take opposition... Just start picking creatures. I don't want to tap my... <clears throat> Fine. I'll take opposition. Ooh, Scarab God. Oh, Coalition Relic too, though. 
Yeah, I would take Relic. But it's late. Like, this is, like, what, third pick? I guess that's not too late, but it still feels late. Worry, worry, worry. Josh, let me mark down that, uh, that stip. Uh, if Oath is in the first seven picks, take and build around. I really like the cards we have for Scarab God right now. This guy's good at Scarab God, this guy's good, this guy's good, this guy's good, this guy's good. Yeah. This, like, they're all good with Scarab God right now. But Coalition Relic seems better, unfortunately. Yeah, we're playing three colors. We gotta take Relic here. Yeah, I agree, and I don't like it. Oh, that's a good dude. Big Daddy Tefs. I do like this Teferi a lot. Yeah. Yeah, we're taking Teferi for sure. I can see I can see Mentor, but I don't think Mentor is... I don't think Mentor... Oh! <laughs> that's a good one. Yeah. Oh! That's a good one. Also a good one. I like this guy, though. Come on now. Don't be too greedy. Come on now. Oh! That's on a good one. Siggy? Yeah, boy. I like Thief of Sanity a lot, but I think we're just taking the Signet oh, here. Oh, Siggy, boy. Giver? Could take Ragdust Signet, too. It's one of our colors. Yeah. I don't think, I don't think we're a Giver deck. I don't think we're an Opposition deck, either, but... I'm going to take... I want to take Signet. Just Michael, take white Michael, creatures, and that's Michael, insane. Michael, all of the time. My name Although is opposition the... is better in a blue green deck. Your face is better in a blue green deck. You're right. Did you trail off there? Were you, uh, did I catch a niner in there? Were you dialing from a walkie talkie? Face of the board. Okay, never mind. Wow. <laughs> Just forget I said anything. Did you say something? Are you talking to me? Who's you? This is me in my, throughout my entire life. Accurate. Boy, Looks I love good. boy, I love clubbing. Oh, yeah, just ultimate price here. Sure. We don't have a ton of removal. God, Stoneforge is looking like trash right now. Yeah, hot trash. Imagine this deck may have issues with aggro or burn. Yeah. What? Well, I mean, we have Bane Slay Angel, Vindicate, Pester Might slows him down. We have Shriek Maw. We have Angel of Sanction. I think we're okay. Whatever, man. Or Chubbing. Nice. Hmm. <sighs> Days came back. We can still get them. I think Condemn is probably better here. Yeah. All right, yeah. I have one got him. And we have man. Yeah, I was just going to say that. This force is also looking a little awkward currently. With the two blue cards, you mean? Yeah. Maybe we're just black-white. Splash to fairy. Oh, I like that. Maybe we're Rakdos. We'll Ooh. see how it goes. Maybe it's sad because all of these are cards. blue. But I guess we can splash the, the Teferi and not feel bad about it. Scarab boy came Get out. out of here with that. Come on. No respect. Put some respect on his name. Oh, I fucking knew you were going to say it. Hey, man, you just put in a blue card. Don't cut the force yet. No, man. I'm. It's going to go on the sideboard for now. Then you're going to forget. This is where I'm going to put you later, you stupid Mitch. You're putting me anywhere. See you try. I don't hate Angel of Serenity, but I don't know if... I've never seen anyone cast this against me. It's a lot of mana. So I like I wonder why cards like this are in the queue. Like I just don't see anyone play them. I mean it seems like no one's in blue black, so Thief might come back. I don't even know what pack it would Wow. <laughs> just phenomenal. Just absolutely phenomenal. So we got a Marsh Flash, which is pretty good for us. We got a Grim Monolith, but we are kind of color intensive. It's also Shell Block Isle. But we could Shell Block Isle and hope to table the Emrakul. Get there. Wow, that'd be sick. 
Also, I just like Glenelinger Archmage here to be to be honest. Yeah, that's good too. Wow, that was insane. I can't believe that last pick thief. I also like Marsh Flats a lot. This pack is very good. Like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight cards that we would we would take. I think Archmage is probably the strongest, especially the Scarab God, Angel of not Angel, but Angel of Serenity if we play it. I'm gonna take that. Oh man, that was that was something, man. Thief of Sanity and Scarab got on the wheel, dude. Yeah, hopefully the flats tables. The Rascal Flats? Yeah. I got my little glovies. I wear them every day. Do you I wear these every day? Yeah. I like this Demir Signet. Yeah, I like Counterspell, but Demir Signet is probably Double better. Blues on, yeah. on, on two is rough. Well, it doesn't have to be a turn two play, though. I'm going to take this one out because I don't think I'm a three Signet deck, but also like having two on colors is cool. Oh, Factor Fiction seems juicy. I like Cloud Skate. Or Factor Fiction? Mm -hmm. What card draw? What card advantage do you have in this deck right now? Uh, we should probably cut Stoneforge, by the way. But um, we're not there yet. Okay. If we're cutting Force, we're cutting Stoneforge. Why? Fact seems fine. Okay, good. I'm glad you agree. I think it's much better than two two Bouncy Boy. Bouncy Boy can be real good though sometimes. Yeah, Factor Fiction can be good all the time. You yeah. ever cast a Factor Fiction? Not when you're like, behind oh. on the board and you're like. I got five cards and like cool you're dead so so you'd say you have five on it in that situation <laughs> I guess I would cool let me know when your hand gets sweaty oh there it goes <laughs> there it goes you want me to tell you you'd be like Michael by the way um, oh there's a sword for us Michael my, my hand is sweaty by the way <laughs> I, you, wanted, sword. you wanted me to tell you when it got sweaty this joke sucks the same joke you make over and over again. What is what? Is I it? do this voice. I say the a couple joke, things. Though. That's not the joke. Oh, I like this Teferi a lot. I looked at that Lotus and I was like, Lotus. And I was like, who what? But it wasn't the right one. Who what? Who what? That's real good, yeah. I wouldn't mind Hero, but I think Teferi's better. I really tend to take Bitter Blossom too. What? Bitter Blossom. I don't know, man. It seems like it's bitter I think Teferi's better by Neferi. himself. Bitter Blossom's pretty strong, though. Blossom might wheel. I actually agree with that. Scrubland? Scrub-a-dub-dub? -dub? As much as I like... Uh, Control magic? Yeah. I think I it's Scrubland. Scrub yeah. Having Underground and Scrubby-dub-dubs is pretty good. Fallen Shinobi? Oh, fudge, Yeah. That's your favorite. Uh, this card's bonkers, especially also in go for the throat, which is worth noting. We have ultimate price and shriek maw and vindicate and condemn. I don't think we're in any. I don't think we're hurting for you boys. You don't think you're hurting for Squirtin? Also, I think Force has gotten a lot better on our deck. Picked up a lot of blue cards. Worry, 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 worry <laughs> about Michael B. <sighs> Ooh, so, oh, whoa. Watery Grave. Watery Grave seems better than arrived here. I'm yeah. Honest with you. Also, sort of feast and famine. Eh. Yeah. Probably take the land. Yeah, I like the land. Oh wow. Metamorph and, and Shell, Shell Dock. Dock. Shell Dock seems good. Yeah, I would take Shell Dock. I'm a Shell Dock. I got Shell Dock on it. I like Lyra. She also pumps Angel Sanctions, Resto, and Angel of Serenity. Yeah. Also, Angels might not get played. Yeah. I mean, it's good when it's good, right? O-ring three things. Literally every card is good when it's good, right? That's true. That's how they work. That's how cards are made. <laughs> well, can, it, can Angel Sanction only hit creatures? Oh, nice. Bruh. Bruh. Angel Sanction only hits creatures, but it bounces any three. If it's an opponent's creature, it goes to their hand. If it's your, you get to target creatures in your graveyard. Right. And then you get them back. Right. So it's like, it could be a draw three when they get rid of your five, six angel. Frosty T? That's not bad. Okay. It's only six drop. It now I like force again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 
Oh, shit. It's like half the deck. Wow, that table? That's insane. Well, I mean, like, we knew it would. <clears throat> now I kind of want opposition. Do, 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 do. I give her all oh. my love. And then wow, jeez. I like go for throw better than ultimate price. Yeah, I agree with that. All right, well, if we put opposition back, this is 25 cards. I don't think we need to play Mana Tithe. I agree with that. Is Stoneforge good with only one sword? We have better boss on though, too. Mm. And plenty of creatures. Mana base is actually looking real good. When did we get this Maze of Death? Was it like last pick? Must have been. I don't remember taking it deliberately. So you're going to go two. You're going to go two. You're going to go four. Also, Bitter Blossom is amazing with Fallen Shinobi, too. Yes. Gives you lots of dudes. Bitter Blossom did table. I like all these fours. I think they're all great. All the fives are really good. Mm -hmm. All of these are very good. I forgot we had Coalition Relic. Jeez. We have Coalition uh, Relic, double on color Signet. Our man is great. Maybe this was the last pick pack one. It okay. might just be Stoneforge herself. Like, you if we draw sword, sword, it's cool, but, like, if we draw sword and then draw Stoneforge, it's just terrible. Yeah. I'm going to cut it. I really want to sneak Force in, but I don't know how we could. I don't. It seems greedy. We got Vents yeah, I just man. don't know what we would cut for. Yeah, we have Glowland's Archmage. What more do you want, my dude? Forceable is a good one. Real good sometimes. It's good. It's real good. I guess we can always board it in when we super need a counter spell. I forgot we had library. Jeez. Flooded turn actually gets all colors, which is nice. So we'll put you over here. Signet. Okay, so. Um blue sources we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Say nine, ten. Black, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Seems fine. White, we have three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Get one more. So this is eight, eight, ten currently? Buy another blue. All right, sounds good. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, which is fine because we have lots of blue. Black, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. White. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And white, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, that seems good. That doesn't even include Coalition Relic, so. Honestly, I think if we can cut sword for force, it doesn't look like a sword deck. No, I mean, we have Bitter Blossom, which is really good with swords. Plus, we can, like I said, we can always board in force. Man, I wish this hand had a Bitter Blossom. We could draw one. This is true. We could top deck. We can get five on it. The only thing this deck is missing is, like, power. We have Library of Alexandria, Michael. What more do you want? It's not technically power. We're going to top deck opposition. You ready? The fact that our mana is so good that we can run Library, too. Tan looks much better with force instead of sword, just saying. Sure. Well, yes, but some hands are going to look, look like at, that. I think you can look at any card with a couple of blue cards and force and call it good because of force. Like, oh, that's pretty good. I got force. Huh? Did I do that? Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. No, goddammit. 
There we go. Nope. I hope it's a remand. Actually, I hope it's a daze. <laughs> it's got to be mana like though. What are you waiting for, Junior? In oh, tune. it's just an Entune. Fascinating. I to respond. I guess you have to respond because yeah, because you can't, you can't do it now. <laughs> right. Then you just don't get a chance to do it at all. Man, the fairy's broken. It's just a non-fun magic card. My article for this week is going to be the biggest mistakes of 2019 card design. Ashen Rider. Well, that dude's a real scumbag. Yeah, that's pretty annoying. I'm actually going to activate here because I I think they're going to Ashen Rider it, so I'd rather just draw a card. Oh, I didn't know you could use them without targeting. Yeah, it's up to. Hmm. Yeah, one of the most popular plays in standard is play Teferi with nothing on board, and for you know the opponent has nothing, and then you just get to draw a card. While keeping a Teferi. I would say they might not have it, but you know they always have it. Should I comment on the Facebook post again? Yeah, for sure. Always when I whenever I. Uh, you making me discard a card? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, Probably sword. Well, yeah, I think it's actually fine. Because next time we can go resto into. Maybe we should have got rid of Titan there. Since Why? It's so Titan? far off. It's two. It's two lands off. It's literally one land away. One land away. I'm gonna play Scarab God here, and if they don't have an answer for it, I'm gonna reanimate your Ashen Rider. Yeah. And they didn't have an answer last turn, or else they would have just cast it, I imagine. Oh, Jesus. Just do it now. Yeah, I'm not even going to wait. So hold on for one more day. And you hold on for one more day. Things go your way. Oh, they're just going to do it in response? They're going to necro? Oh. Oh. Hold on for one more day. Oh, you don't care about Grudge. I don't care about either of these. If these both go in your hand, that's totally fine. Yeah. You actually don't want this to go to the graveyard, I imagine. Why not? Because then I can reanimate it. Because oh, I, yeah. I have Scarab God. He's hiding. It's fine. I would just scoop here. There's no way you can win. Yeah, we get to kill one of those lands, right? Yes, my article will include Teferi and validating an entire card type. I when I was writing my list, I wrote I started writing my list tonight of the uh, the worst mistakes in standard, right? And uh, I was actually surprised at how many there were. Oh, are they gonna show me? Oh, that's fantastic. So I put Grudge in your hand, but now I can get rid of your Badlands. Oh, I can also just get rid of your. Yeah, blue just get rid of the island. We don't care about Grudge. They kill a chicken. That's totally fine. Isn't it that whenever the guy leaves play or enters play, he does it? Uh, whenever he dies, I think. Oh, it's enters the battlefield or dies? Yes, dies. Okay. Okay. So he can be path, but he can't be. Well, they don't look like they're playing white anyway. So. I don't foresee them pathing, my dude. I think it's it's almost weird because I feel like we almost put them in a position where they had to take Sphinx. Otherwise, we just get it back. Yeah, this game's over. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this, this is GG's. Unless they want a Toxic Deluge for five and then lose then their bad lands. The Scarab God back. Right, we get Scarab God back and they lose their Badlands and they take five. Yeah, that seems... And then we untap play Frost Titan, tap down one of their... Okay. I mean, I guess he had to do it. Did he? Now Frost Titan just taps down one of your lands so you get one land. Yeah, this game's over, my dudes. Oh, boy. Berserples. <laughs> <laughs> Berserples? Yep, this is pretty good. Oh, and then they're like, yep, that'll do. Wow, that was brutal. I did. I do actually want this guy over the sword. I do. Berserples, my dude. <laughs> Brazungas. Are um, you going to consider things like how Ren and Six doesn't even fit into the Magic Universe in any way? It just has three of the spikiest. Yes, Ren and Six is also on my list. Uh, I'm pretty sure most, if not all, cards on my list 
not not all. Um, I don't want to go on stream because I don't want to give your your article away, but I'd like to guess the cards. Is it how many of them? Did, oh, hold on. How long was the list? Um, the I think it's like seven or eight cards. Okay. What do you What do you think they are? Uh, Ren and Six. Okay. Well, because I said that. Okay. Oko. Okay. Uh, small Teferi. Big Teferi. <laughs> Junior and Senior. <laughs> uh, once Upon a Time. Oh, shit. I actually forgot about that one. <laughs> That's It's so funny because there's like eight cards on the list and I literally forgot one. And they're uh, all from this year. That's all I got so far. Okay. Uh, all really? of those are right except for... No. No, two are wrong. Two are wrong, actually. Okay. I'll keep this hand because it looks great. It just looks great. Was Teferi Grande 2018? Oh, wait. Was that this year? No, I think Teferi... Big Teferi was like last year. Okay. At least last year. Oh, I forgot about Narset. Yeah. Basically, all the things that affected three or more formats. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good bazorpal right there. <laughs> you know the best part about... Well, most of the people viewing probably don't even have any idea why we're saying that. <laughs> Just so we're clear. What's your favorite Star Trek character, Berserker? <laughs> like, oh, yeah, that's cool, man. I hope it's another situation where we just they, where they just don't have any way to get this guy out of the graveyard. There's no way they have two games. Where they have I really need to sleep with this stream. It's far too entertaining. Right? Yeah, get wrecked, Joshums. Josh, it's also only twelve thirty, man. You can you could you could stay up a little bit longer. But his time? Yeah, he's in uh, he's in the California. California, here we come, right back where we started from. Michael, grab your gun. Michael weighs a ton. Michael's number uh -oh. one. Berserpal. Uh oh. Well, I guess they get to hit us. They're probably just going to I kind of want mana, dra mana, mana Tithe too here because if they're trying to do some nonsense. Yeah, fast. they're going for like turn one and turn two stuff. Joke's on them. They can only gain six and lose seven, so they're actually going to take yeah, a big a, a fat hit. Stupid dummy. This is never resolving. We're dead. We'll see. Berserples. Yep. Oh, cool. I guess I'm just going to go to the next game then because reasons. Let's uh, bring in the tithe. You can probably cut like... What'd you bring in? I brought an ultimate price too. Oh, because it can Look at all these five mana. Ah, uh, Shriek Moss sucks. Yes. Opposition. Pr eh, could be good. All Shinobi is a four. Ruffling is a two. I think I like Frost Titan, honestly. It's pretty slow. I, I, I can see that. I want a Shallow Graven. Can we do that? Is it their... their, their it's, no, it's it's, oh, okay. it's yours. That would have been cool. sweet. Resorples. <laughs> um, yeah, I'll keep this on the play. Oh, we could have brought in Maze. Yeah, that I don't think Maze is that great. I don't know. It kind of like shuts down their strategy. Pretty right, hard. but I just don't want to spend a, a land drop doing it. It's definitely worth it if it's like they just can't win. Well, I don't think they can't win. We already saw Ashen Rider as one of their main threats. That kills a mana Maze of Ith. A mana Zavith. But if they have like... A main A Zavith. If they just have like a... Uh... Uh... Uh, uh, we also have three colors. Yeah, I agree. Like, I just think it's too hard on the mana base. Uh, we can switch out library for just it. Just stop it. You're being a child right now. Well, it's good against, like... Um, oh, he's still going. Uh, it's unbelievable. The big demon. The big demon? Yeah. <laughs> Can't remember his name for some. Gristle Brand. There we go. Bazorpal Brand. Bazorpal Brand Crunch. Oh, that's rude. <laughs> I'm just going to vindicate their stupid land now. Which one, though? Probably the blue one. See? See how Look you like it. Look what you did, you little jerk. 
You have that on the board, do you? <laughs> no, I don't actually. That's a good one though. Look what you did, you little jerk. Oh, they had them in blue. Shit. You got a couple spaces left. This seems real good if it survives. They're gonna mana leak it. They better. Ooh. They didn't. Oof. We get an untap. He also haven't put anything in the graveyard yet, so. Now they're just gonna go in. Oh. Live in the dream. Deluge for Live two. In the dream. Okay, then we'll get one. They'll get a one one back. Yeah, if they go Gristlebrand and we're like, oh, I'll just send them back home. It's like, all right, so you get to draw seven and hope you find an answer to my maze in the seven cards instead of... They actually get to draw like four. 14. Yeah, they can still draw 14. Discard a card. Yeah, go for the throat. Sure. Get my bird back. Not only do we still get one counter out of it, if it dies, we can get it back with Scarab God too. If he dies, he dies. Oh, triple five drops in hand. This is my life. Jeez. Land would have been great there because then we can go Teferi untapped lands to yeah, that'd keep Bazorpal Borp up. <laughs> we gotta stop. Like, no one knows what we're talking about. Everybody knows, man. They know Bazorpal Borp. What are you doing? Just making sure that was... Quit playing, Michael. Oh, that's, that's unfortunate, too. Yeah, we would have to tap out of blue. These planes are real pain in the ass. I still don't feel like taking the shields down. Yeah, they really have one key spell and the game is over, so no reason to put the shields down. Oh, the old Bazorbaldorp? Yeah, we go way back. Bazorba what? Oh, wow. This is... Well, you got it. We are getting chubbed so hard. I don't even know what that means. I don't want to know. I don't either, man. I'm out. I'm out. Oh, boy. All right, we need to land here because we can tuck it with Tef. I'm a big tuck it with Tef fan. Oh, bullshit. Well, hi, you're watching Tuck It With Tef. They have exactly one red. It's going to be I stupid am dead inside. You ready? They're going to kill all of our perms. It's going to be great. And I'm going to wish we got rid of this with our stupid Vindicate. And the whole game is going to be changed. Not the worst. No, that's actually just fine. That's just one for one. Yeah, that's totally fine. I mean, I'd rather have the thief on board, obviously, but... Ain't no sunshine when she goes. Oh, all right. Guess they don't have a counter. Oh, wow. There are so many more. Oh, wow. Was that this year? Nexus of Fate? Was that this year? I think so, because it was M19, which was released. Corset 2019 was released. No, that was 2018. That doesn't count. Okay, good. I know it's been around for a while. Ain't no sunshine when she's gone. Are you just getting... You're just getting a Leshnorn back? That doesn't even seem that good. That's mediocre at best, my yeah. dude. I mean, I guess it's technically a threat, but... But is it? Well, it invalidates some creatures. I mean, Berserpals, dude. <laughs> so it's one, two, three, four... Berjingas. Please stop. <laughs> <laughs> Berjingas. <laughs> Come on, man. That's pretty good. So what do we do here? We could tuck it. Yeah, we tuck it. Yeah. We could also just get this guy. It's a 3-3. Three, three. Do we want to take another 4? I think we can take 4. Tucking this, what does it do? Like, they're never going to be able to cast it. 
If we tuck this, this goes back in the graveyard, which must be better for them. Well, they just... Look. Oh, we tuck this, yeah, and then this goes to the graveyard, and then they just have to recast this. Yeah. That's what yeah, I mean. that seems good. Michael B, he goes away. <laughs> Michael B, he goes away. He goes away. Go away, Michael B. All right, so they're going to go one, two, a third from the top? Yeah. Third. Okay, so one, two, Alesh. Okay. Okay. They have the two cards. They actually don't have anything to attack here. Tef gets to live. Uh, let me actually check real quick and see what my my list, how many cards my list has. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. It has eight currently. So you can see now. It actually has nine after I add this one. There are nine cards in this list. Oh, I forgot about one of those. Yeah, I bet you did because they're all freaking. Yeah, because it feels like a lifetime ago. It does, yeah. You're like, oh, wow, that was this year. And yeah, it was. Nope, not that one. Okay. Once upon a time was the added card, yeah, because Mike mentioned it. And I didn't. I, I was like, I forgot. There are so many broken and banned cards that happened this year that I just forgot them. Oh, uh, I don't think Urza's actually broken. I don't think he was a mistake. I think it's just a really powerful card. It's pretty. It's pretty. It's pretty good. Like, let's be real. Wow, we get to untap with Teferi. One, two, three, four, Seems five, deep. six, seven, eight mana. Let's just get a second black, I guess. I kind of like that, just taking this, but I also kind of like Scarab God here. Well, their main threat right now is the sneak attack. We don't care about the graveyard currently. Right, but if we, like, the sooner we get Scarab out of line, the sooner we get the Glenelendra. Yeah, but Sneak Around, Sneak Attack plays around that anyway. Oh, we actually could have played Scarab out untapped two lands. Well, it'd be on top of the end of the turn. So. Right, but that would keep up. We, then we can still get this back out of the graveyard, is my point. Oh. All right, I do feel like they have to play a little more fairly now. Oh, they're gonna pay costs. Here we go. Repeal. Repealing Teferi. Okay. So they're gonna draw Leshnorn. So two. Wait, no, they're repealing this. Teferi's ab okay. I was I was hovering over the Teferi ability. That's unfortunate because now they get to. I wish I. I guess it wouldn't have mattered because I, they would have un, they would have uh, bounced the Scarab God before. Yeah, and then they wouldn't have even had to bounce the Scarab God because, yep, Teferi dies. This is actually fine. Whatever. Yeah, but this is the only gas they've shown us, so... Oh, they're gonna play something. Oh wow. None of these things I care about. Unless Norn dies too. Yikes. So they have one card in hand, and our hand is just like just insanely stacked. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight mana. Still not enough to do two things. Wait, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, that's rough. That is a roughy roughy duffy. 
You can play Scarab God, suspend. I guess. I kind of just want to play Angel here and take this again. Because, again, like, if there's so many cards they can draw that are just... Like, Gristlebrand's terrible. Sure. And we don't give a single F about no Nighthawk. Well, they snuck in an Eleshnorn just to kill Teferi, and they snuck in an Eleshnorn just to kill Thief of Sanity, so... It's definitely, uh... Some bold strategies caught in here. Well, I mean, can't really blame him. Like, you gotta get rid of that guy. Oh, God, Eleshnorn again? Jeez. So many Eleshnorns. I guess so it, I'll though. take this. Oh, f oh, I forgot to do the thing. Oh, I'm gonna be real mad if I draw land, which I'm definitely going... <gasps> okay, good. Oh, okay. Actually, Lyra seems pretty good here. Did you hear my leg pop? I heard something pop, my dude. It was my leg. It is legs day, my dude. Actually, Lyra's not great here. Oh, we're going to fly over and we're going to fall in Shinobi and see what we can yeah, hit. Yeah, that's what I was talking about. This does give them back their sneak attack. It's a price we got to pay, Michael. Gristlebrand. Ashen Rider. That's pretty good. And we haven't played a land? Oh, yeah. This is why Fallen Shinobi is just absolutely just oh, a shit get show. for free. Oh, yeah, you didn't know that? You think? Oh. It's not Thief of Sanity, man. I would just kill the sneak attack, right? It's got a Leshnorm. Why would we kill the sneak attack? Then they just attack us for a billion. Oh, well, I guess we just block, right? Yeah, sneak attack is the only thing we're scared of. We're not scared of the Elish Norn, right? Yeah, if we kill sneak attack now, then we get to block and we just kill whatever we want. Yeah, right. You get to cast it for free. It's free real estate. Was that a Tim and Eric? Yeah, yeah. It sounded like a Tim and Eric. I was quoting the chat. I know what you're doing. I know about you. What's your pick for meme of the decade? Meme of the deck of the decade? Yeah. Oh shit! It is twenty twenty. That's crazy. Oh god, I don't know. It's man. Tough. There's a lot of good. That's ones. really hard. For you, I imagine it's something from the office. Oh yikes! That's fine. What are they gonna do? Kill one of my creatures? Okay. Yeah. I mean, I still don't like them having it though. Really. Oh, do we kill the Elish or do we kill the... No, we kill this, then we steal this next turn with Angel. Okay, yeah, and then kill the... And yeah, then we okay. just kill the Bolas. Gotcha. They have no cards in hand. Also, if we draw a land, we can go Scarab God, get back Ashen Rider. That's pretty good. Where did Elish, hey. where did Elish Norn go? Is this Exile? Oh, shoot. Yeah, it's Exile. I mean, that's actually pretty good. Yeah, I was like, there's Cape no. Ship is in 2018. Cape Ship's been out for years, boy. Garbage day. It was just reprinted recently. One, two, three, four. Let's add a red. One, two, three, four. Activate. One, two, three. So we can actually go Venser Bounce. I want to get the hit with this guy, so that's what I'm going to do. Um, activate one, two, three. Good, 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 garbage day. Nicobolus, your face. Oof.
I think this game's over. You got it. Cause it's happy birthday, Michael. Happy Berzorpals, Michael. This is round one. Jesus, this match is taking forever. Oh, wow. Yeah. I feel like I've aged a hundred years. My family won't even recognize me anymore. <laughs> they didn't recognize you to begin with. Wow. Oh, there's so many nuts things we could hit. We could have just killed them, but I don't care. I just want a cube. Oh, but we could have killed them? How? We have a wandering funeral on the board. Oh. It's okay. We're going to hit Gristlebrand eventually. In Tomb? I don't really want to do that or the other don't one. Don't we? Oh. But we can't get their stuff though, right? No, we search our library. Okay. And put something good in our graveyard. One, we can't two, search three, their, four, their library and put it into our graveyard? Their library? <laughs> yeah. Let's see if we want to, if there's any Scarab God targets we can put in there. Mm, it's like Sun Titan, right? Or Frost Titan. Oh, wait, we boarded it out. I don't even know that. Yeah, we got Resto. Resto's good though. Uh, One, two, three... Four, five Berserpals. Yeah, killing them would have been solid. Meh. I just want you guys to know I could have done it. I mean, this is game three, right? So I don't care. Yeah, there's no way they're coming back from this. I don't know. Like, they have one card to draw. I don't know what it could be. Like they damnation. can't even activate a Gristle Brand. It had to be like Damnation for them to even start to come back. What does that do? I got Scaram gone. I mean, it's the only turn I can think of that buys. Then I'll kill them with Wandering Fumarole. Oh yeah. So actually, that doesn't work. I have the actually damn That's hilarious. They have one card left in hand, huh? What are you considering? Oh, we know the last card is. Um... They have Vampire Nighthawk Rock. That's yeah. the last card. Yeah. They did. All we gotta do is Angel and Sanction the Vampire and attack with the Fumarole. Am I doing this? So I can counter it. Oh. Good good call. I mean, they're just gonna recast it. But. With Glenelanger Archmage? How do they recast it? Oh, you're doing it with that. Gotcha. I thought you were getting the Venster. Venster's, Venster's on, board. on the board. <laughs> Never mind. Are you drunk, bitch? <laughs> I might be. It's getting a little late, man. I thought you were going to activate and put the Venser from your board into the graveyard and then reanimate it with the Scarab God. Oh, I was going to say, GG's, don't kick me out. Don't kick me out. What? Bruce. Bruce? Yeah. Is that your brother's name? Yeah. Bruce Bartholomew? This old BBC. What's the C for? Never heard of that acronym? BBC, the British Broadcasting Company? Yeah, I've yeah. heard of that. But what does it have to do with your brother Bruce? What's his name? What's the C stand for? Comcast. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? Comcast. Oh, old Bruce Bartholomew Comcast. How much would you say you have on this cube... Tree fitty, maybe ten. I think I got five on. <laughs> oh Jesus! Oh Berzorpals. It just sounds. It's just a funny thing to say. Oh God. Oh, I love it when they play Mox Pearl on the turn one. They don't, on the turn, they don't do anything with it. They're like, I just want you to know, I have it. Okay, buddy. All right, buddy. I believe you. I believe... No, I believe in you. Calm down, buddy. All right, my dude. So they're playing Mardu. More like Mardu. -Doo. Wow. Got him. Do we play Signet or do we... Are we I'm going to play Signet. They don't have any threats currently, so... Look, I got a Mox Pearl too, dummy. <laughs> we don't. It's basically the same thing. We both have the same amount of mana. He, this was free, but he didn't even do anything with it, so. Wow, what a dummy. Nothing, huh? Okay. Wow. I got five on it. I'm gonna... Colonnades to spend? 
Uh, yeah, I, got, I can get behind that. There was a time like a couple weeks back, I don't know if you remember, but I had five on it. Do you remember that? No, I don't. Well, I had it on there, okay? Who are you calling? Your mom? Nope. Tell her I said hi. Don't tell her that. I don't want to talk to her anymore. <laughs> oh. oh, two moxes. He's like, go ahead. They just they, they didn't do anything again. I don't understand. Why are they just playing their moxes? It's turn four. They've played two lands and two moxes. So, like, they've literally just played land, moxes instead of lands this game. This is a total Brazorples matchup. <sighs> I'm about to bust. Yep, you got it. One down. Sent you some money. You sent me money? Yeah. For what? Because I forgot to pay you for the Hungry Howies. Oh, shoot. I just remember that. Wow, that's crazy that you just remember that now. I don't know why it popped in my head, but I was like, wait a minute, Hungry Howies. Hey, wait don't a worry, minute. it's friends and family. I always check. I always check. Guess I could have scummed you there. <laughs> I would have just refunded you. What? I would have refunded it. No, I meant like I could have just never paid you for the Hungry Howies. Oh, that's true. I could have yeah. remembered it and just not said wow. anything. Wow, you would have been a real derp. Wow, look at this, man. They just use they just two for one themselves because of this lady. Have you played against that card? It's good. nuts. It's good. It is good. This guy coming down? No, next turn. He'll be back. Oh, I like that guy. Oh. Do we just want Grave? Do we just want Scarab God here? I think we do. Scrabble will dabble you. He'll dabble you? Yeah. I just didn't know how to pay Frank as a vendor, friends and family. for. Yeah. I'm like, dude, just go. Just don't even... Don't even. You know what I mean? Just don't. Just don't do it. It is turn six, and they have they have six mana with two moxes. Uh, it's pronounced moxin, Frank. <laughs> yes, when you say... Oh, they didn't do anything. We don't have a Scarab God. Oh, good lord. They took two here? Maybe they're like an upheaval deck. Do we have a Vence? Why did they, they... This is untapped? I don't know. I guess we'll find out. I guess we will. I guess we bounced the pain land, right? Yeah, that's something you wanted this mana, so we'll just make him come back and have a thing. Okay, you paid two, but didn't you? I don't know what's going on right now. I'm gonna be honest with you, I'm real confused. I'm real confused about some things and stuff, man. I'm gonna that thing. I don't think we need to play another spell besides leave the I think we are just fine. If we had another land, I would play Teferi, but I'm not too worried about it. We can also just reanimate this and counter any spell they have, so. Why did they take two? I don't know. Okay. okay. So we know they're playing mostly Char red spells. We know they're playing Char and Lightning Bolt. <laughs> and they're also red, black, splashing some colors? Or they're just I, I playing moxes and no those splashes, nothing? That was the weirdest thing I've ever seen. Could bring in the Sword of War and Peace here, but... I don't think I've man. seen enough to, to really determine. Maybe they're an aggro deck and just didn't get there. I don't know. We kept like a slow hand. That did not look like an aggro deck. Well, I mean, they played Bolt and Didn't Char. look like it, Michael. Okay. Just let it go. No. Uh, was that the Avengers edition where they go, Bazorples? No, they do that in every issue, Michael, because that's this what nerds Morgan. do. You don't like this hand? No. I got Relic on it. It's real slow. Doesn't really do anything. Okay. Oh, that's sad. We're on the draw, though. I'm going to send it back. So we just go library and next turn draw? I like that. D Mulligan. My name is D Mulligan. Oh, name, they took two. My name is Jiminy Smith. Jiminy, huh? Mm -hmm. God, I feel like your parents really have to hate you if they name you Jiminy. Why? Because that's a shit name. <laughs> wow. 
buzzsaw poles. Michael, can you not look at my buzzsaw poles, please? No. Call two cards a turn seems pretty good. I'm no expert. You're definitely not. Wow. Amateur hour, am I right? Considering I don't get played to the play, don't get paid to play this game. I don't get paid. You are correct. Said Michael B. So we still have seven cards in hand, and we have one more mana than they do. Good lord. Fucking library of Alexandria. What were they thinking, dude? Uh, my eyes are up here, buddy. Stop staring at my bizarre <laughs> Good one. Thank you. Thank you. You think they're going to... Oh, they discarded Burst Lightning and Runaway Steam... I have no idea what this deck is. Is it like this every day with you two? Yeah, for sure, man. We even do this when we're not on the stream. Yeah, so. this isn't even a stream thing. This is just how we interact with each other. It's exhausting, but... It's, you love it. It's good times. You little Mitch. Wow. Maybe it's Thousand Year Storm, maybe. Way to take credit for my joke. Hey, I'm going to make a joke, but I'm going to tell you that Josh in the chat said it. He's like, the chat's right in front of him. He's It's closer to him than it is to me. Is Mike the reason why Frank is gray? Mm. Probably. Wow, that's a good one. Oh, that is a good one. You know what's even better? Bazorpals. No. We can't tuck that mofo, though. I could steal it. You saw you said we can? Yeah, let's yeah. do that. Oh, we can angel it? Let's do that. What do you think the B in Mike B stands for? It stands for Bazorbles. Frank just walks around all day singing songs about Mike B and saying Bazorbles. You're at least half correct. So if we play Teferi, we actually go down to six cards, which means we can still draw a card next turn. I'm okay with that. Plus, I don't really want them to untap with the cheese. Oh, plus we also get Teferi, so that's a good thing too, I guess. So again, one, two, Jace. One, two, look at my Jace. So they got Burst and Lightning Bolt in the graveyard, which is nice. Oh, this gets some more. I've closer. had enough whiskey tonight that I'm pretty much just laughing all the time at the stream. Thanks, dudes. But also, I'm also F for work tomorrow. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Stays up late and gets drunk. Oof. Oh, Josh. Just tell them it's President's Day. And they'll be like, that's really not. And you'll be like, yeah, it is. Just, just, just reassure them that it is. What? Don't care about that. Bazorpals. <laughs> I guess that cuts us off black, technically. No, I don't. I mean, it don't. But I guess I maybe can they think they do it. Oh, here we go. This is their. Oh, they a twin deck. I guess they're comboing. My alarm goes off in two hours. Good lord. Oh, you might as well not go to sleep. Is your alarm letting you know to go to sleep? In two hours, go to sleep. I need to know. Bazorbles is us uh, poking fun at Sheldon saying Bazinga on Big Bang Theory. That's the joke. Because that oh, show's dude. garbage. Wow. Aggressive. Aggressive take. <laughs> That's perfect. Just beautiful. I'm going to draw a card. Then you can draw another card. God, there's so many freaking cards, dude. Um... I'm going to draw a card. I have nine cards in my hand. I got nine cards in my hand, but don't call me a card head. A card head? Well, you know, it's like from the thing. You want to go with hand there. Uh, I'm, I'm fine. I'm fine with whatever I go with, okay? So one, two, untap library. We get to draw again. Oh, Jesus. This guy has a family. I mean, we have Go for the Throat now for their stupid Bazorpals. I only have to deal with 75 7th graders. It's cool. Oh, no. Oh, Gamma Set. You oh. done messed up. Oh, dear. Yes, that was an Andy Milakis reference. It's my show, I'm Andy Milanakis. It's my show, I'm Smandy Smilashmakis. Bazorbles. Oh, <laughs> is, is it too much, you think? 
I think so. Ooh, I'm going to draw a card. Because good lord, man. Oh, God. We go to nine cards here, and then we get to Teferi and go to ten cards here. Jesus. I can't even play cards fast enough to... Uh, Keep up with your own system? Uh-huh. So one, two, three, four, five. We're going to have to discard something. Like, Oh, no. Whatever. Well, shall we're we definitely do. activating Teferi, right? Like, so. Yeah, who are you kidding? I want to hit, like, four. Oh, that's good. One, two, three, four, one, two. Yeah, this is actually. I'm probably just going to discard four, five. And then we have one, two, three, four up. I don't like that. I'm actually just going to discard two lands here. Uh huh. I don't think we need a flooded strand anymore. I don't think so either. Hey, I'm gonna play a little Deceiver XRK. Okay, here I go. Okay. I think I tapped out Teferi, you think? That'd be so sick. I have my doubts. Yeah, good point. Little island, huh? Okay. He will die. Okay. It is dead. Now I only have to discard one card. And I can untap the lands. Oh, baby. Should we factor fiction here? In response? I mean, if he doesn't do anything, I think we do. Really? Jesus. We're going to go to so many cards, man. Who cares? I get to flip the Rescanta. We still got 22 cards left, man. That ain't deep enough. It's true. They still have Jace in their hand. We know that. Jace and three. Mm, okay. Jace and three. I guess we have Colin to just bust a, bust a Jace wide open. Three, four, five. Activate it. One, two. Yeah, we're just going to take it. <sighs> Teferi will stay at one, I suppose. Um. Why not? <laughs> oh, boy. Yeah, I'm just going to play Bouncer here. What are you bouncing? It's their wandering funeral. Actually, probably there is Kanta, right? Yeah, that seems better. Sure. So this guy's gone. And now you have Jace. They got a sneak attack. Dude, these decks with sneak attacks are so weird. Are they going to sneak attack their Jace, you think? Just play a Scrubby Bubby. Draw a Cardi Wardy. A Cardi Wardy. You heard me. You heard. What do you got here? Deceiver Exarch, Runaway Steamkin, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. We have basically 10 mana. I wish we could play creatures at instant speed. Oh, I guess it doesn't matter because we can just get their Deceiver Exarch out of their graveyard. That seems insane. Plus, they haven't shown us any reanimate spells yet, so... You know, well, no, they that. have sneak attack, though, is my point. So, well, like, if they that. go sneak attack Eldrazi, we get to tap it down with the Seaver X arc. Oh. Gotcha. I'm trying not to die, Michael, okay? This game is remembering me of Tomer and the other EDH players from MTG Goldfish. Like, if we're going to lose, I'm going to go on my own terms, which means draw on every card in the deck. I mean, they have 18 cards. We have 19. They've still actually seen more cards than we have, so. Which seems weird. How did that happen? 
Uh, they thirsted. I don't know. That's weird. I feel, like library. The library. I feel like we've drawn way more cards, but... Uh, yeah, that's fine. Show me what you're working with. Shake your ass. Oh, because they were putting things in the graveyard with this Kanta, for sure. Ah. Uh. Dire Fleet Daredevil. Good go for the throat. What does that do? Kills our Scarab God for a turn. He might as well respond. Well, I guess he hasn't cast it yet, right? How can, what can we what can we do in response? Nothing. Might as well reanimate something. <sighs> My concern is if they have one more big fat idiot in their graveyard. You mean in their hand? Yes. Yes, I do. Uh, does untapping, is there anything we can untap? Tap their land. So just tapping in response. Oh, yeah. Dang it. Still going to do it. Woo! Okay. Go for the throat. Come on back. Okay. Oh, they didn't even attack. Attacking into a 4 4 seems pretty bad. Right, but this guy dies anyway because of the sneak attack. So if I block here, they kill Teferi. If I block here, Teferi still takes one. Mm hmm. So. I guess it was a free attack, basically. Right. You either trade this guy for Teferi. Or Teferi takes one. This guy was going to die anyway. So. Let's go to 11 cards, huh? Why not? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Puts them to six. I'm pretty sure Angel of Sanctioning yeah, this thing. Yeah, definitely that. That'd be crazy not to. Tap sneak attack. Can't activate a tap thing. That's good. That's a good if only that worked. Uh, one, two, three. And two more. One, two. I'm just going to actually tap library here. It doesn't matter. Do I play land? Yes. Also... Something that's real sweet. Oh, we don't have Scarab any more shit. That's actually kind of scary. Why? Um, because if we have Scarab God, we can actually reanimate Dire Fleet Daredevil and get like a Braider Lightning Bolt if they try to go off and combo us. How but are if they, how are they gonna combo? Uh, they can literally play Kiki Jiki, copy this guy, one, two, three, four, five, copy this guy, get Pestermite, play Pestermite, and kill us. Ah, like it's definitely an option. So actually, I kind of want to kill this guy. I do that. Because it means they have to have two spells instead of three. Yeah, might as well get rid of that possibility. Bizarples. Plus we have four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen damage on board, so. Here comes Jace. No, search for his counter. Oh, that does nothing. I just hold. I just slower. Okay, so you have Jace and one other card in your hand. I don't understand why they're holding Jace. They like, can block with a fumeral. Not if I don't want them to. Yeah, the play they could be like Jace, bounce the angel, oh. use sneak attack. I don't know what's going on here. Oh, did they just get shuffled with the Imperial Recruiter? Oh, that's interesting. Oh. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 
Scarab God. So they block what? They block four, they take five. Can that bounce lands? Yeah, this guy can hit anything. He can hit anything that you desire. Magic dip did he. Where's my force of will at? I mean, you can always factor fiction for it if we really need it. It's true, I guess. And you got one more dig out for the library. This is nine damage. That's unsatisfying. One, two, three. Oh. Don't like that. Why? Because, like, we could have left our attack prediction in case we do need to dig for force. We untapped two lands of Teferi. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I always forget about that part. You do. You do. Uh, those Oracles. <laughs> Get rid of this relic. You're not doing me any favors here. Impulse, huh? You got it. This is round two, right? All right, good. Jeez. Our deck's not very fast. It's good, though. Oh, they went on their own terms. Beautiful. All right, let's finish it off. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out on twitch.tv slash frankleport, patreon.com slash frankleport, cool stuff, inc.com, patreon. I said that one already, didn't I? Hit Man the, of Traders. Hit, hit the YouTube subscribe feature. Hit that YouTube. Use that subscribe feature on youtubes.net. You know, the one where you pay. The membership feature. There you go. Um, also, if you guys are looking for a sub sweet subscription service, uh, you can go to manatraders.com. They rent out MTGO cards and physical paper cards. I'm not sure if they've started up their physical paper card feature again, but uh, if you guys are looking for ways to what test up, modern Andy? or pioneer decks, definitely check out manatraders.com. You'll get 20% off the first three months of any subscription with the link and promo code down below, so definitely use that. How can you check me out on Twitch again? You can go to twitch.tv slash Frank Lepore. But that's mostly directed to the people who are watching on YouTube right now, not on the, not on the people watching. You can me. also go to robsmom.co. You can go to robsmom.co. That's true. That's a classic. That's a classic bazorpal. Uh, I like it. I love uh, it. It's real good. I want more of it. And we got that force of will protect. These things go south. And we can vindicate their land like a little jerk. Look what you did, you little jerk. Really looks like a Vindy juicy, juicy target. Oh, I'm gonna play that. <laughs> yeah. Do you like? Do you like that? I do like that. Jesus. <laughs> oh, classic. this is a classic. Look, will my dad ever come back? Hmm. I'm not sure. Man, me neither. <laughs> Draw a card. Play a land. And starting out with the library is really nuts. It's not a fair. It's not a fair ability. Yeah, me neither. Let's go get an underground seat. An undie bundy. Oh, I like a good undie bundy. An Al undie bundy. Is the guy in the background a copy of you from a parallel universe? Yeah. Did you just give away our secret? <laughs> From the trash can universe. Univorce? <laughs> Univorce. And in, in his universe, it's spelled Univorce with an O. Yeah, everybody knows that. Though. Everybody knows it. What is this? It's going to be Jason. No. No, my dude. No, thanks. Teffrey or Factor Fiction? I think Teff's way better. You think Teff is better? Yeah. You play with that card? Yeah, but if they don't have, like, Factor Fiction. Have you played with Factor Fiction? Yeah, good point. They're both pretty good. I don't really like getting rid of either of them, but... 
I like fact a because... A planeswalker for a planeswalker. I like fact because it lets us fill up our hand again to uh, turn on our library if need be. That's true. Oh, what's this clip? Thanks, Mike B. Thank Mike B. Oh, this is this one's great. Thank you so much, Mike B. You don't get enough credit after a tough year. So my wife getting sick, my dog going blind, having diabetes and cancer. Really bad time to be my dog. And me now in the hospital with blood clots. I turn on Frank and see you there behind him. And I say to myself, well, it could be worse. I could be Mike B. Wow. <laughs> Thanks, Mike B. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Jeez, is that nuclear got him? <laughs> Dude, that was got him from orbit, man. Yeah, I didn't expect that at the end of the sentence. That's one of those hole up. Oh, you got to turn your speakers up real loud. But she says, uh, "Hmm, I'm not sure." And then Mike B goes, "Yeah, me neither." Man, they have nothing on board. When we get the fact, juicy or fiction, either one. Are they gonna play something else. Riffling Claw. Shoot. My dude. I'm pretty sure I just take whatever three pile there is. Oh, we can actually take the best pile because we'll go up to six, draw a card for our turn, and then we can still activate library, so that's pretty insane. I gifted that guy a sub after that burn. That's because, like, I was totally like, wow, this is a really nice message. He's going to thank Mike, and he's going to, like, it's going to be so nice. But then, like, he actually is just like, I could have been Mike. Think <laughs> of how much worse that could be. I'm 100% taking this top pile. Don't tell anybody, but I'll take the top pile. Choose a pile to put in your hand. This one. Yeah, I don't think that was a good split. They just gave us three removal. I guess maybe removal is not good against them. I don't know. I actually think I'm pretty sure I'm not going to draw here. I'm just going to play a land, an Angel of Sanctions, their Worn Power Stone. Uh, I don't hate that idea. Oh, good, because I was going to do it. To stop scary things. I like how Mike is just a little bit invisible now. He doesn't want to use full ninja abilities. This remembers, this remember me. Uh, reminds me when Frank used the green. Oh, the green screen mask. I still got that whole green screen setter, but the problem is like it's real thick, so it's real hot. That's a thick boy. Oh man, I haven't used this guy in ages. This is a classic. Mike could actually go full invisible if he didn't eat so many McNuggets. <laughs> wow. <laughs> you like that one? I did. I did like it. And I was planning on getting up early to get a haircut, but it's getting real late. You know, if you just went in your bedroom after this and went to fucking bed, you'd be fine. That's impossible, dude. But instead you're like, well, it's five now. I gotta watch at least three hours of YouTube. <laughs> Thunair, thanks so much for the reset, buddy. Welcome back to the internet. Uh, wow, that's that's desperation right there, my dude. I will make you draw one less card this turn. <laughs> you want fewer cards? Let's play the creepy. We could also, yeah, vindicate that. Just a little O-ring on O-ring action. I'd like to think that this is someone's first impression of this stream. I always hope oh, that. <laughs> wow. 
Wow. Bazorpal's my dude. The glasses should go inside the mask. You're right. That's better. They're going to face fetters, this guy? All right, I guess you're just never getting your thing back. I'm going to take this off now, though. You got it. My butt hurts. <laughs> so you might say your name is now Bobby Butt Hurts. It might be. Oh, it's old Bobby. Hey, look, it's a hunter. The hunter has appeared. He's never hunted anything. You're right. Come here. Get up here. Yeah. I got that little face. Oh, what up, big dog? Hey, buddy. Hey, cutie. Okay, see you later. Goodbye. Dang. Their bazorpal has resolved. Why do you encounter it, idiot? Because I'm just too stupid, Michael. No, that makes Did sense. Did they just play Mox Diamond? Oh, they they discard a planes. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, they have seven mana. They're going to cast something for seven here. They're just going to activate Shambling Vent, and they just wanted the Black Source. Okay. That's completely underwhelming. They're like, I gotta win however I however I can. Gotta Ooh. be on that grind. Let's play Shelly. What we got? Survey says. Fallen Shinobi. Any order. Uh, do I just draw a card here? I could go draw a card and keep go for the thread up for this guy. Two, three, four, five. Well, I'm definitely drawing a card. Three, four, five. Oh, we can also attack next turn and bounce shriek. No, we can't. This guy's under here. <laughs> I'm like, I, I'm nope. like, I'm like playing like this guy's in my hand. You cannot introduce you from under the shell block. No, that is not. I can working. do whatever I want. Stop pretending like you're my dad. How do we only have 16 cards? I guess actually Factor Fiction is a is a beast on your deck. A beast on your deck. I'm a beast on your mom. Are you really? Yeah. That's really awkward, man. Can, Why? Can you be less awkward? No. Yeah, I didn't think Impossible. so. Yeah, I'm on Inconceivable. Three, four, five, six, seven. I'm pretty sure we're actually good uh to never do a thing again. I don't know what that means. If I never draw a card again, I think I'm pretty fine here. Why, why wouldn't you? Because we we have 15 cards and like we just... Man, we had a game where we had six cards left and you're like, it's fine. Now we have 15 and you're going to chump out? Chump out? Yeah. Chump out. Chump up, chump up and get down. Chump around. I think this game is over. That's what I'm saying. We can also bounce our vents here. Oh, when do they I even suspend more. that? Give me more. Matthew, I don't ever want to be a Siamese twin with anyone. That sounds like a miserable experience. And I, I actually feel bad for Siamese twins because it sounds like it's an incredibly... Yeah, fun... you can never be alone. Right. It it's, yeah, it feels like you lack a lot of the, like, basic comforts of life. And how do relationships work? My dad. Your dad. Hmm. Okay. Oh, my dad. I don't understand, but... And you never will. Matt, how'd you do in the old poker game? Bazaar balls. I'm about to play poker for way less stakes on Wednesday, but... You play for stakes? <laughs> yeah. That's cool, man. What kind of stakes do you guys play for? Omaha. Omaha. Somewhere in middle America. Every time it's a threesome. Wow. Hmm. That's... That is Mike B is the tumor baby from Hellboy. I don't remember that. The tuna baby? The tumor baby. Hmm. Whatever, big tuna. <laughs> hmm. You, you can tell you're ahead when your opponent just gives up on activating library. They're like, you know what? I just want to play cards now. I don't even need anything else. Break me off a piece of that fancy feast. I left up about 580. Ooh, that's real good. Good for you. How much did you put in? I was playing 1-3, so my guess is the buy-in max is 300. So that's almost double your money. That's pretty good. 
Is it? Is it pretty good, Michael? Unless you bought them for way less and just actually destroyed them. That's what they're like. No, don't look at my deck. Pew, 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 pew. Now we get their cards. Oh, yeah. Ugh. Nope, not doing that. Nope, Ugh. not doing that. Ugh. I will play your land, though. That's pretty cool. I like playing a good land. Good to know they have balance. Jeez. That's dirty. I definitely need to play the max, could attack and the buy is like 500, which is crazy, but I played a total of 280 and left with 860, but I tipped a couple people. That's still pretty good. We won. Break me off a piece of that, Michael B. So you quadrupled up? Yeah, that's pretty good. <sighs> quadrupled up. Must have been a lot of all-ins. Oh, yeah, I guess it would be about triple. 280 times three, yeah. Still very good. Okay, I'll keep it. Sometimes you just gotta give, you just gotta have a mediocre hands so that are like, God, I, I always want to draw Tefri when they get their Ancestral. I like turn four of this guy and then just, you know. That's a good one. Did you just go quiet? Did you just have a stroke? Yeah. Do I need to call the hospital? You can. You can. You know what? You go ahead. If you want to do it, that's you fine. Can call your hospital. Have fun. That's not mine, Michael. I don't own the hospital. You don't? Dang it. Sorry. That Tell you... me you did. Thought, thought I could get a discount. Well, you know what they say. I don't. A friend in need goes to the hospital indeed. <laughs> That's true sometimes. I like that we do a venter for this. We can just go put it back. My friend is having a bazorpal. <laughs> That's very serious, sir. Stay on the line. Bazernga's. All right, you got it. Annoying, but fine. I accept your thing that you did. Teferi, 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 Teferi. Oh, dang it. I mean, you still get EOT, Resto, Angel, and what? then Shinobi. No, we're venturing this Ancestral Vision. Oh, true that. Bazinga. Do it again. Try again later. All right, I guess. Also, if they don't do anything or play a guy, like we just get to attack Shinobi, this and Shinobi, that's... Oh, God, I'm real excited about Shinobi being here. Let's hope it works. Also, bouncing a Venser to do so is just nuts. Yeah, having him in your hand is good. can't counter it so they have to have like a path oh god they have something it's gonna block it don't well, they can't block this part, right? it is now it's past blocks unexpectedly absent sure colonnade <laughs> Elspeth. Nah, I'm just going to vindicate that. Library is no longer good.
It's a lot of mana to do that tar pit shinobi combo. Yeah, that's a bit expensive. Plus you have to bounce your land, which is a little awkward. It's awkward. It's true. Bazinga. Bazinga, my dudes. Okay, Hunter, enough. Hunter's ripping the space-time continuum. Hey, cutie. He's very cute, though. Everybody knows that. The whole world? Michael, the whole world knows it. Boop. Let me boop. Oh, no boops. Okay. Oh, Josh with the old minus plus asterisk. That's good. All right, so I have two cards in hand. Vindicate my colonnade. Sure. Annoying, but not the end of the world. You have one card? Oh, so they us with a slightly better man land. So three, four, five. Oh, that's real good. Oh, that Fallen Shinobi is going to have an attacker soon, boy! One, two, three, four, one, two. I might just play Resto here because they're going to draw. Have we shuffled? No. Okay. So they have one card. Yeah, I'm just going to play Resto because they're bouncing it anyway. Give me that Shinobi. Oh, biscuits. It's like it never happened. Uh, okay. bounce bad. We discard cards. Then yeah, no, we're not bouncing. Get to play a shell dock. They do get to draw cards. Yeah, but what are you gonna do? Whatever. I'll just play shell dock again. Oh, Lyra. Oh, Force of Will's nice. Yeah, it's a good surprise. That's a Gotham Deluxe. Oh, I'm I playing I... two mana counter spell. I'm wondering if I should just not let this resolve. What do you mean? I mean, we have Venser again. Like we could have just Venser again. I'm... Oh sure. And then we could have blinked it and ventured again. Like, we could have just never let them resolve and draw three, but. Did you get him and Mike from the same shelter? Wow. I got I got Hunter, like, nine years ago. From a shelter, yeah. He was, like, a year and a half old. Hunter's actually ten, and it always surprises me, because I'm like. That's bro, crazy. How are you this old? Are they gonna wipe the board? Are they, gonna, are they gonna wrath of God? Their wrath is totally fine. She got a bitter blossom on the board. Can't find a better blossom. My leaves in trash cans and leaves. What? No one cares about that. <laughs> Say what? Caracas. I can't even block our shinobi profitably. All right, so these are all. I'm confused. Gonna hold off on a land because if we hit a land off of Shinobi, in case they don't block. Just a chump? Weird. This is all very weird. So they have two cards in hand. And we have Venser plus a counter spell under our shell dock yeah. plus Resto. It's not good. Like we could actually vent our own fallen shinobi and attack with this guy next turn just to trigger it, but I think we just Yep, yep. we just won the game. I'm gonna open this treasure chest before uh before we leave. Open one of these. A conqueror's pledge and fifteen play points. Actually deal. Yeah, it's alright. Thank you guys for watching. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. I'll see you next time. You guys have been great. Thanks for watching.